Hi, my name is Maria Isabella Son. I'm from Iliwi National High School, and my study is about the evaluation of Montilla Calabura as a natural anti-diabetic and antioxidant. And the advanced Hello, my name is Indigo Aponte. I'm a research teacher of um, Maria Isabel, and I'm um, glad to have this teamwork. Um, so, from the formulation of this research, I started in grade 9 ko, and also, I conduct my kids some experiment, and um, I started some May last year, and I finished some uh, July last year. So, why did you conduct this study? Because, um, Sarita, it is a plant that grows everywhere in our community and it is often neglected or people pay limited attention or minimum attention to this particular plant. And um, diabetes is one of the, it's a very serious problem not only here in the Philippines but worldwide and it is one of the top causes of death according to the World Health Organization. And um, so, what drives you to push this plan? Um, because research actually is uh, you do research so that you could solve solutions to real life problems. So um, that's what uh, drives me to continue or to do this research because diabetes, as I said earlier, is a very serious problem. Um, especially in our community and I know a lot of people who have experienced death of a lesson because of that. What are the struggles that you have encountered du during the, the conduct of the research? So one of the struggles um, is that we had to find an institution in which um, they could cater to all of the assays that I needed for this research or to complete this research and also um, that institution was the Department of Science and Technology Food and Nutrition Research Institute in Manila. So that was also another struggle because I had to balance my time here in um, in the National High School because classes were already um, going on and I was still conducting my experiments so I had to fly back and forth to, to conduct um, who are the persons behind this success? Yes, so there are a lot of people behind this research. Um, number one is my research advisor, si Dr. Renita B. Aponte, because um, she did me ang tao na nagbuli with sa ako. Since sang formulation palang sang study ko and pagpangita palang sa mga um, subjects for this research, so I wouldn't be here if it weren't for him. And also, ang ako na parents, because uh, grabe kita ang pag-support ang nila sa Apple. Um, not only sa um, financially, pero they also help me grow as a person. And also, um, grabe kita ang pasalamat ko sa uh, Department of Education and the uh, Kokongway Brothers Foundation because uh, these two institutions, especially ang GBF, um, grabe kita ang pag-finance ng aming dalang matrip. Um, going to the U.S. and also they paid for the, men the mentoring that we had to undergo so that to further enhance the Amunia skills to uh, defend the Amunia research. So what can you say to other student researchers? How do you see inspire? So ang ako, walang na message sa ila is to dream big. Um, don't stop believing in yourself because um, you know, just shoot for the skies. Okay? Um, nothing is impossible. Kung magbibig ka man lang sa self mo, and just keep praying and have faith lang kay Lord because siya lang nakabalo kung ano nang pati sa ulihin. Um, sir, as an advisor, how can you define Lyson as a student researcher and at the same time as a nurse? Uh, okay, so about Maria Isabel, well, she's um, a student, a typical student, but not that someone that you don't really encounter every day. Although typical, uh, because she's having fun, and at the same time she is also focused, and then because she has a purpose also, so um, she always find time to enjoy 
although we she's in the hectic schedule of doing a lot of things like doing experimentation, gathering of materials, and even working on the manuscript in uh, preparation for the concept that she has to gain beyond the the usual concepts that are learned in the classroom because she has to advance her learning reading about diabetes and how the mechanism of diabetes and then um, for uh, she has the purpose the purpose is to really achieve something worthwhile that can contribute to the community and then it's her passion to go on research because she loves doing research learning new things and i think because of these three uh, core um, perspective that she's into that will describe Maria Isabel as a student.